Water sustainability in agricultural systems is an important issue in today's agricultural community. Climate change, demand for increased agricultural production, and increased urban use is making sustainable water use in agriculture more and more challenging. As you can see from current water shortage examples such as the drought in California where they're having trouble finding enough water to water their crops, this is a serious issue and it's going to become more and more prevalent in the near future. 70 to 80 percent of water used is in arid regions which are already water stressed regions. 40% of food produced is on the 20% of irrigated land. The good news is that there are many more efficient options of irrigation than we are currently using. The goal of irrigational efficiency is to minimize water evaporation and maximize water absorption by the plant. To start, we can focus on plant breeding characteristics that help in low water situations. For example, we have bred a type of sorghum that maintains its green leaves during drought. This helps maximize water use during these dry times. Another thing that we can do is change the type of irrigation we are using. Rice is the most water intensive crop and feeds a huge population. By using a mulch in rice pieties, you can greatly lower the water used in rice production. Zy pits can be used in arid situations such as sub-Saharan Africa. They are excellent at catching rainfall and have been shown to increase production by up to 50%. Subterranean drip lines can minimize evaporative loss in crops such as spinach. We have many options for irrigation. We just need to match the correct option to the correct production system. Let's start by educating the farmers that they have more irrigational options that are more efficient and that are cost effective. Together we can make sustainable water use a reality.